Snake grass, Clinacanthus nutans, and its benefits. Clinacanthus nutans, commonly known as the Saba snake grass or Belalai gaja, is a plant native to Southeast Asia. It has been traditionally used in folk medicine, especially in Malaysia and Thailand, for various purposes. However, it's important to note that scientific research on Clinacanthus nutans is limited, and the information available may be based on traditional uses rather than robust clinical studies. Some potential benefits and traditional uses associated with Clinacanthus nutans include anti-inflammatory properties. The plant has been traditionally used to alleviate inflammation, and some studies suggest that it may possess anti-inflammatory properties. This could be useful for conditions involving inflammation, antiviral activity. There is some preliminary research suggesting that extracts from Clinacanthus nutans may have antiviral properties. This has led to interest in its potential use against certain viral infections. Antioxidant effects. The plant contains compounds with antioxidant properties. Antioxidants help neutralize free radicals in the body, which can contribute to overall health and potentially reduce the risk of certain diseases. Wound healing. In traditional medicine, Clinacanthus newtons has been used topically to promote wound healing. Some studies indicate that it may have properties that aid in the healing of cuts and wounds. Anti-cancer potential. Limited research has explored the potential anti-cancer properties of Clinacanthus nutans. Some studies suggest that it may have inhibitory effects on certain cancer cell lines, but more research is needed to validate these findings. It's crucial to emphasize that while Clinacanthus nutans shows promise in various areas, more rigorous scientific research is needed to confirm its effectiveness and safety for specific health conditions. Before using Clinacanthus nutans or any herbal remedy, it's advisable to consult with a healthcare professional, especially if you are already taking medications or have pre-existing health conditions. Herbal remedies can interact with medications or have side effects, and individual responses can vary. Additionally, the field of herbal medicine is continually evolving, and new research findings may have emerged. While Clinacanthus nutans has been traditionally used for various purposes, it's important to note that scientific research on this plant is still in its early stages, and more studies are needed to fully understand its potential benefits. Here are a few more points to consider. Anti-diabetic properties. Some research has suggested that Clinacanthus nutans may have potential benefits for individuals with diabetes. It may help regulate blood sugar levels, but further studies are needed to confirm and understand the mechanisms involved. Antimicrobial activity. Preliminary studies have indicated that extracts from Clinacanthus nutans may have antimicrobial properties. This includes activity against bacteria and fungi, suggesting potential applications in treating infections. Dermatological uses. In addition to wound healing, Clinacanthus nutans has been traditionally used for various skin conditions, including insect bites, rashes, and skin allergies. Its anti-inflammatory and anti-pruritic, anti-itch properties may contribute to its effectiveness in these cases. Hepatoprotective effects. Some studies suggest that Clinacanthus nutans may have hepatoprotective properties, potentially protecting the liver from damage. This could be of interest in the context of liver health and certain liver conditions. Traditional uses. In traditional medicine, Clinacanthus nutans has been used for a wide range of conditions, including fever, urinary tract infections, and respiratory issues. However, it's essential to approach traditional uses with caution and rely on scientific evidence whenever possible. Safety considerations. While Clinacanthus nutans is generally considered safe for most people when used appropriately, it's crucial to be aware of potential side effects or interactions. As with any herbal remedy, individual responses can vary, and some people may be allergic to certain components of the plant. It's recommended to consult with a healthcare professional, such as a herbalist or a doctor with expertise in herbal medicine, before using Clinacanthus newtons or any herbal remedy. Additionally, keep in mind that the regulatory status of herbal products can vary between countries, and it's essential to ensure that any product used is obtained from a reputable source. As research on Clinacanthus nutans and other herbal remedies progresses, more information may become available, 
contributing to a better understanding of their potential benefits and applications. Immunomodulatory effects. Some studies have suggested that Clinacanthus nutans may have immunomodulatory properties, meaning it could potentially influence the activity of the immune system. This could have implications for conditions related to immune system function, but more research is needed to understand the specifics. Anti-allergic properties. Traditional uses of Clinacanthus nutans include its application for allergy-related symptoms. Some studies have explored its potential anti-allergic effects, which might be attributed to its anti-inflammatory and antihistamine-like properties. Potential for skin conditions. Beyond wound healing, there is interest in the potential use of Clinacanthus nutans for various skin conditions, such as eczema and psoriasis. Research in this area is limited, and more studies are needed to establish its efficacy for specific dermatological conditions. Mode of action. While there is evidence suggesting various therapeutic properties of Clinacanthus nutans, the exact mechanisms of action for many of these effects are not fully understood. Further research is required to elucidate the active compounds and their interactions in the body. Traditional medicine practices. In regions where Clinacanthus nutans is traditionally used, it plays a role in local healthcare practices. Understanding the traditional knowledge surrounding the plant and its applications can provide valuable insights into its cultural significance and historical use. Cautions and contraindications. While Clinacanthus nutans is generally considered safe, it's essential to be aware of any potential interactions with medications or pre-existing health conditions. Pregnant or breastfeeding individuals and those with specific medical concerns should exercise caution and seek professional advice before using herbal remedies. Bioactive compounds, Clinacanthus. Newtons contains various bioactive compounds, including flavonoids, glycosides, and triterpenoids. Identifying and studying these compounds can help researchers understand the plant's therapeutic potential and mechanisms of action. Preparation for different illnesses. The preparation and administration of Clinacanthus newtans can vary depending on the traditional practices of the region and the specific health condition being targeted. It's important to note that while there are traditional uses of Clinacanthus nutans, scientific evidence supporting its effectiveness for specific illnesses is still limited. Before using Clinacanthus nutans or any herbal remedy, it's advisable to consult with a healthcare professional or a traditional herbal practitioner. Below are some general ways in which Clinacanthus nutans is prepared for different purposes. Fresh leaves. In some traditional practices, fresh Clinacanthus nutans leaves are crushed or juiced to extract the liquid. The juice or crushed leaves may be applied topically to wounds, insect bites, or skin conditions. Tea or infusion. Dried Clinacanthus. Newton's leaves can be used to prepare a tea or infusion. To make a tea, dried leaves are steeped in hot water for a certain period, and the liquid is then consumed. This form is often used for internal consumption and may be associated with purported benefits, such as anti-inflammatory or antiviral effects. Topical applications. The plant may be prepared as a paste or poultice for topical application. The paste can be made by grinding fresh leaves or mixing powdered dried leaves with water. This paste is then applied to affected areas, such as wounds or skin conditions, capsules or extracts, Commercially available supplements, capsules, or extracts of Clinacanthus nutans may be found in some markets. These forms are often more convenient for those who do not have access to fresh leaves or prefer standardized dosages. Combination with other herbs. In traditional herbal medicine systems, Clinacanthus nutans may be combined with other herbs to enhance its effects or address specific health concerns. The combination of herbs can vary based on regional practices and the intended purpose of the remedy. Dosage. The appropriate dosage can depend on factors such as the form of preparation, individual health, and the specific condition being addressed. Dosages and administration methods should be determined in consultation with a healthcare professional. It's crucial to exercise caution when using herbal remedies and to be aware of potential interactions with medications or adverse effects. While traditional uses of Clinacanthus nutans exist, further research is needed to establish its efficacy and safety for various health conditions. 
If you are considering using Clinacanthus nutans for a specific purpose, it's recommended to consult with a healthcare provider to ensure that it is a safe and appropriate option for your individual circumstances. It's important to emphasize that the quality and reliability of clinical evidence play a crucial role in establishing the efficacy and safety of any herbal remedy. If you're considering using Clinacanthus newtons for a specific health condition, it's essential to consult with a healthcare professional. They can provide guidance based on the latest research and help you make informed decisions about its use, considering potential interactions with medications and individual health characteristics. For more videos, please click subscribe, like, and share buttons. Thank you for watching.